Something I need to talk about are your domain of sine and cosine, all right? Especially with your calculators and such, all right? Look at here. We have the unit circle here. From here to here, that is x. What is the domain? Well, it goes from negative 1 to what? 1. And what is the range of all our answers? Notice the smallest y is what? Negative 1, and the largest one is 1. So your domain and range only run from negative 1 to 1, especially on the unit circle. So therefore, the cosine of t can only be values between what? Negative 1 and 1, and sine t can only be values between negative 1 and 1. And here's another reason to think of it. Which is always the longest side? Anywhere you make a triangle here, back to here, the radius there is 1. The radius is going to be the hypotenuse. It's the longest side. If the longest side is 1 and everything else is shorter, then when you're dividing by a bigger number, you're always going to be less than 1. You're always going to have a fraction. All your answers are going to, since, be fractions. Okay? So, 